I guess we're starting this again. To all of my beautiful people, how you doing? It's been a while, eh? Same guy, same here, same same doing my thing. Uh, right now, I'm at A1 Cash and Carry in Mississauga. This place is fantastic. It's like, it's a restaurant supply sort of place, so they have everything in those sort of sizes, but it's enormous, and they have everything you could ever want. Um, I First time I was here, I actually walked around here for about three hours looking for things and going around and doing things. So, uh, you know, if you're in the business and you're here, this is the place to come. If you're going to pick up stuff that you need for, you know, doing a business or large scale sort of stuff, I'll speak their praises. And that's not a paid advertisement. I'm just a fan. Speaking about this, it's been a while. Uh, this last year, 2019, it's been about survival. I'm not gonna lie to you, friends. Uh, the place I was living uh, before, uh, I was living in a house, it got sold for condos. So I had forced to move, which moving is always terrible. And I was, you know, not really in a good space to do it because uh, work kind of dried up a little bit um, through the winter months, like last year again. But you know, things got better. Uh, one of the cool things that I actually got to do uh, from doing these videos uh, was I got to actually work in television. Crazy, right? Uh, so I got to work on a cooking show for Gusto TV. It was called DNA Dinners. Uh, I'm sure that you can find it out there. Uh, and I got to be a sous chef with uh, some really talented people who did some, like, we did some really, really cool stuff. Uh, and I made... A little behind the scenes video, I guess, a little music action. So why don't you guys check that out? I'm going to head in here and get some stuff uh, for what I need to do today. And I'll be back in a bit. And yeah, we'll check this out. All right. Got the first one down. Yeah, I'm sorry to have me say that was an important Hey, Mo, you're going to cut this up, right? Huh? I, I think you should.
There we go. Wasn't that fun? The lighting here is terrible because it's such an overcast day. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that. That was, uh, I want to give some special shout outs. First, Chef Nathan, thank you for letting me come work with you on that. That was freaking awesome. Uh, also to Dave and Sarah who made cameos in it, the kitchen crew back there. Um, you know, I miss you guys. It was fun. It was a whole lot of fun. I hope that we get to do something like that again, hopefully one day. I don't know. But now that we're done here, I got back here with all the stuff from A1, and uh, I'm gonna show you guys what uh, what I do with this stuff now. Uh, I got this new project that I started, and it's uh, it's kind of really close to my heart. So uh, I'm gonna take you inside and give you a little sneak peek, and then uh, yeah, so come take a look at this. Check this out. This is out of the cold. Out of the Cold is a program that looks to provide a hearty, warm meal once a week to some of Toronto's less fortunate. Open from November to April, it's available at several churches, synagogues, and other locations throughout the city. I'm lucky enough to work with St. Andrew's Church in the heart of downtown Toronto. I work with a great group of volunteers that help to create a three-course meal I'd be proud to serve to anybody. To find out more, check out the link in the description. Hey! Stop. Stop. That's it. <laughs> And that was out of the cult. Uh, I am going to do a lot more on them next week. Uh, so I'm going to have another episode out real soon. Uh, but right now, I'm going to head home. Because we're done for the night. And I want to thank you for being here. I want to thank you for tuning in. And I promise you, I will be back again sooner than later. Alright? So, for me, to all of you, deuces to uses. It's good to see you guys again. All right, take it easy. Thanks for watching. You made it to the end of the video. You want some more videos? Click one of these. Or to get any new information, just visit chefmotoronto.com.